Hey, this is How Do You Do It, and I'm going to talk to you about my uh, do-it-yourself shortcut for zone control heating or a smart vent. I just made a video where I showed you how I, I just take this uh, inline fan that I bought at a do-it-yourself hardware store, and just with a little simple duct work, I can put a booster in any room I want, either a, you know, a warm room in the uh, winter where I want to boost that heat, get a little more of the warm airflow from my furnace in the room, or I could also use it opposite for air conditioning a, a room in the summer. So now what I'm going to show you real quick is how I can add a thermostat to this so that, you know, the way I have it now is I plug this in and it's on all the time, right? So I'm just plugging it in and then the inline fan is on. But with a simple thermostat unit, they sell these, like I said, at the, at the do-it-yourself hardware store. This one's called Duckstat, but the idea is it has a, a heating or a cooling setting. And uh, I'm going to put it on heat. And then there's some sensitivity controls. I'm not going to get much into that because it's pretty straightforward. But basically the idea here is what this says here is on heat, when it senses 3 degrees warmer, it'll turn on. Or 7 degrees warmer, it'll turn on. So the idea here is you know, your furnace is going to blow warm air through, through your duct anyway, right? So when the, ther when the furnace turns on and the warm air starts coming through, if you have your inline fan plugged into the thermostat and the thermostat plugged into your cord, into your power outlet, and then the thermostat senses the warm air coming through, it'll pick up that... Uh, Sent that, that change and turn the fan on. And that way, when, say, the, the furnace goes off and the temperature cools, the fan will turn off. That's just a quick kind of way to cheat and um, only have, the, have your do-it-yourself uh, zone control fan on when the furnace is on and it turns off when the furnace is off. Um, there's probably more sophisticated ways you can wire that into your, your heat system. But this is, like I said, do it yourself. I can buy these components, put it in any room. I can move it around a room. And it doesn't cost me that much. And, uh, you know, it does the job. If what I'm after is just a simple solution to warm a room up. That's all for now. Thanks for watching.